The 9-11 hijackers for a period of time oh, shit. lived on Jameson Avenue. Okay, did, were they Crips that grew up in the neighborhood and everybody knew them? Absolutely not. Nobody knows who the fuck those guys were if you were to go ask us all. We don't know who the fuck they were. I want to cut a hole in that fence, man. There's probably security cameras. Oh, don't cut holes enough. in any fences. Don't even bro. say that. Man. Don't cut holes in any fences. He's, uh, he's, he's hypothetically talking. You want me to turn this off? So you're like, I don't, 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 don't want to say something. What, what was it? Uh, sorry. No, but seriously, we need this place to be safe. If, if okay. I'll put it to you this way. Okay, if something goes wrong, off. those guys hit the chicken shit button. Oh, yeah, true. That's the camera. But Jesus, bro. That's what we started the conversation about. Don't worry. I can't upload it. Remember. Yeah. I can't load Facebook for some reason. My internet turns on and off. And fuck, I swear I'm being fucked with by everybody. But here's the deal. Oh, and I was going to say. Dude, a lot of people get fucking censored on YouTube, and they it's good to have your videos on like BitChute and Rumble and all these different platforms, because YouTube is like the strictest. I've got cloud.mail.ru. BitChute would never fucking censor you. I'm going to start uploading them to my world in Russia, if they don't fucking leave my account alone. Yeah? But, but I won't because they can take the original video file and find information in the original video file that YouTube doesn't broadcast out. Have you ever been on BitChute? No, I have no idea what that is. It's a less censored YouTube where you can fucking bitch you, man. There's I'll put it on Facebook because I don't make money off YouTube anyway. There's all sorts of alternatives to YouTube. But yeah, fucking YouTube's fucking. If you go in the middle of the road there, the storm drains is 1957. This facility was built, I think it was 1953. The same year the Chalk River NRX facility blew its roof four feet in the air. Everybody that saw it saw a green flash, but nobody got a picture of it because it was 1953. If you read the book of popular science, it's 10 volumes. It used to be 10 volumes, the old one. What do you mean everyone saw a green flash? A UFO? Huh? What do you mean everyone saw a green Nuclear, uh, it's called, uh, oh I forget the name. It's G, so there's a, there's a term for it. But when, when, when you reach criticality with uranium, plutonium, anything, when you reach criticality, you will tend to see a blue, blue with plutonium, it's blue. Uh, different things will glow different colors. Tritium glows typically green, I think it is. Oh, fuck. You understand what I'm saying? That's why the fire exit signs are all green now. Because they're filled with tritium. They're, they're not plugged in anything. Well, ours are plugged in, but a lot of places, you can buy an exit sign and just stick it to the wall and it'll glow in the dark for 20 years. It's basically guaranteed for 10, but it'll still be glowing in 20. They put a date on it that tells you when you got to replace it. I got to get out of this building, man. I know you want to stay here to protect here. the neighborhood. No, no, you're safer here than anywhere else. I guarantee you. What you got to, does your bathroom fan work? Uh, it, it dies every two years. It dies? Yeah. My bathroom fan works, yeah. Anyway, you just I, I leave it on at night for white noise. And no, no, check this out, check this You should leave it on all the time. I think First of all, which it shouldn't be necessary if the building was being ventilated properly. It's not. But if you leave it on all the time, then at least you'll have constant. The, the way the way you mitigate radon, when uranium decays naturally, it puts out radon, and radon to, to mitigate the effects, you just have to exhaust it, and it'll dissipate into the atmosphere, and it won't hurt you any more than it would outside. It naturally occurs out of the ground. Where we're standing now, technically, yeah. if you dig deep enough, you will find a little tiny bit of uranium. It will eventually decay, and there will be radon coming out of the ground, which is a gas instead of a metal. It's really weird, because you can take things from gold all the way through lead. Like alchemy, except it's radio... I swear it's very complicated, but it actually... It's alchemy. It's new age alchemy. The first top secret video or films from Britain about this shit referred to it as a nuclear fire. That's what they called it, an atomic fire, nuclear. They didn't call it. They didn't call it nuclear power and shit. Oh, fuck. Fucking. If you if you leave your fan running all the time, you'll be fine. Oh yeah. At least the, the, the problem okay, is where your air coming into your house comes from. That's the thing you don't have a lot of control over. Yeah, my windows open all the time. So. Or that too, leaving your window open. Now they did a study. They did not mention uranium or radon in this article, but I read the thing about it. It said they did a study that showed that if you if you leave your I think it was I think it was if you sleep with them open or if you, just, if you have your windows open all the time even just one window open all the time it cuts your risk of cancer in, half, in, in like half or some shit I'm not 100% sure what it did that's what they said in this study I don't know if that's 100% true if you sleep with if you have the windows open you're less a lot less likely to get cancer what it is all the plastic and shit in our house oh yeah the worst is now, that real car? Canola oil. Stay away from canola oil. Stay away from uh, polyunsaturated so. fats. Tell, tell me we're not in World War II times. Look at all the bicycle messages everywhere. Salud, sir. Oh, yeah. Yeah, true. Look, look at him go. He doesn't need gasoline. He doesn't need insurance or a license. All he needs is a pair of shorts, really. Yeah. Fuck. Anyways. Some 
Woody, see you around.